The Jets are reportedly interested in Kawan Williams. What does that mean for Brian Poole? Jets Nation, Jets GC back with another video. If you guys are new to the channel, please subscribe. We love having you here. And Juan support. Williams, the cornerback for the San Francisco 49ers. He has played from 2017 with them to currently 2021 as he is a free agent. He was an undrafted guy out of Pitt. He also grew up in Montville, New Jersey, so very close to the New York Jets. He's a 5'9", 185-pound cornerback. And what does this mean for Brian Poole? Bringing in Kawan Williams would be the end of the Brian Poole era with the New York Jets because Brian Poole is a slot cornerback, so is Kawan Williams. So Kawan Williams would be the slot cornerback in that system, and Brian Poole will go to another team. Here are both of their stats, Brian Poole and Kawan Williams, just to see their last three seasons. And then I'm going to give my take on how I feel about the situation, but I'm going to pull up the stats for you guys just so you can see the... So you could put your own opinion into Brian Poole. Brian Poole played for the Atlanta Falcons in 2018. He had 55 solo tackles, three interceptions. He was targeted 73 times and allowed 52 receptions, giving him a PFF grade of 61.3. 2019 for the New York Jets, Brian Poole played 14 games. He had 52 solo tackles, one interception, got targeted 53 times and allowed 33 receptions. Also had one forced fumble and that gave him a PFF grade of 79.0. Finally, last year for the New York Jets, Brian Poole only played nine games but had 41 solo tackles, two interceptions, got targeted 40 times and allowed 27 receptions, giving him a PFF grade of 77.1. 18 of Kawan Williams, he played 14 games for the San Francisco 49ers. He had 43 solo tackles, no interceptions, got targeted 45 times, and allowed 33 receptions, giving him a PFF grade of 66.7. In his 2019 season, Kawan Williams played 15 games, had 38 solo tackles, two interceptions, got targeted 60 times, and allowed 43 receptions, giving him a PFF grade of 77.2. And also had five forced fumbles. The San Francisco 49ers, Kawan Williams played eight games. Only played eight games for them. And he had 16 solo tackles, no interceptions, got targeted 26 times, and allowed 18 receptions, giving him a PFF grade of 66.2 and also had one forced fumble. Right, I'm going to give my final thoughts on the situation. Kawan Williams is 29 years old and Brian Poole is 28. So there's only a one year age difference. Kawan Williams is more of a, a guy that will go out there and get you a couple of forced fumbles. Brian Poole is more of a ball hawk. In my current idea, like what I think should happen, I think the New York Jets should go for Kawan Williams. But the thing that sucks is I really would miss Brian Poole because he had so many good years for the New York Jets. But if we could bring in a cornerback who doesn't have to learn the new scheme that Robert Sala is bringing in, that's a plus for us. And Robert Sala will know how to use Kawan Williams, unlike Brian Poole, so that will save us so much time. And I also wish that we could have at least got something for Brian Poole instead of just letting him hit the open market and signing with another team. But that are my thoughts. What are your thoughts? Put it in the comment section below. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe already. And Jets Nation, I'm Jets GC, and I'm out. Peace.